Greetings from Notre Dame Stadium, where we just wrapped up the 2023 Blue Gold Spring Game. I'm Tony Simeone with the two-time Pro Bowler, 12-year NFL man Kyle Rudolph. We saw some really great football on display today. The big story coming into this season, though, is the quarterback position. It's always of great intrigue at Notre Dame. Sam Hartman, a five-year man at Wake Forest, decides to play his final year in South Bend. We saw him on the field for the first time today. Kyle, what were your biggest takeaways? I think you just look at the comfort that you saw from Sam Hartman out there. The comfort in the huddle, the comfort in the system, the comfort with the technique. It's been harped upon us all day yesterday, just the slow process. Coach Freeman talked about managing expectations for Sam Hartman, the prolific career that he had being one of the ACC all-time leading passers, but taking it day by day as we go throughout this spring, realizing that there's going to be some growing pains early in the spring. Sam touched on it in his interview today. Some of the throws that they missed early in spring ball, they hit today in the game. Yeah, you saw today some of those stats and highlights. 189 yards in just a half a play, 13 for 16, throwing the ball, two touchdowns. I think that's what everybody wanted to see coming into today's game for Notre Dame. Now, as we look forward to 2023, it's always a great schedule. Notre Dame plays just such a great dynamic schedule. I'm going to show it to you right here. I like all the games, and I like all the games that are on NBC. But I have a hard time looking away from September 23rd. Ohio State comes to town for the first time in 27 years. They were last year in 96. Last season, Notre Dame opened their season in Columbus. I thought they played them really strong, came out on the losing side. When you saw today's game, you've been around the team this week. What has to happen for Notre Dame to beat Ohio State in this building on September 23rd? You hear it from the guys around the building all day yesterday. They want to win every game they play. It's one week at a time, but it's really hard to, to look at the schedule, look at the month of August and September, and not have this one circled on your schedule. It's an incredible opportunity. They say they want to be national champions. They want to beat the best. Ohio State is a great barometer here in South Bend. It'll be great to watch that game in about five months on September 23rd, but in just 18 weeks, August 26th, the Irish kick their season off in Ireland against Navy on NBC.